Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Locked Up with the Law. Starring your host, he is one half of the MSW World Tag Team Champions, the GWA World Backyard Wrestling Champion, GWA and MSW Hall of Famer, and the Chairman of the GWA, Lawrence Alfred. Nice, nice, nice introduction. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very special edition of the Walk-In Clinic. I am your host, the MSW World Heavyweight Champion and the owner of MSW, The Clinic. Now, as you can see, we have two talk shows going on at the same time. The first ever joint edition of the Walk-In Clinic. Just want to let you know that most of the attention is going to be on the highest rated talk show in backyard wrestling. That's my show. Really? Yes. Well, let me tell you something. Yes. You see, we came together for a purpose. I was prepared for you to tell me something. So go ahead. Go ahead, tell me something. You see, first off, let, let me get to my match with Derek Knight. Go ahead. I hit him with the clinical depression. Ouch. I locked him in the STF. Yes. So quite frankly, I won that match. Really? And I know there was controversy over the fact that I hit him well, with the belt. Well, the record book says DQ. Well, really? Which means he wins. Well, we'll see about that. But... First up, I know we have a very special joint announcement, so why don't you start off with our special announcement. Which special announcement? Which one? Well, we are going to be putting together a special joint show sure. of... Alright, everybody knows that back in the day I became the uh, AWE owner. And in respect to the old owner, we have the belts and I sent some of the crew out to go and win the belts from the, uh, the, uh, the old people. And they came back... Victory is just like tradition has been today, if you know what I'm saying. And what's going to happen is we're going to have a joint edition AWE MSW show coming up in July called Clash of the Champions, where the AWE title will be unified with the MSW Champions. Right, and uh, why don't you tell us what the big main event of that show is going to be? Or, sorry, yeah. Well, you know, D-Master has become the American Continental Champion. That's right, the WWE Continental America's Champion, D-Master. And D-Master has been a very, 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 very famous name around here. Therefore, D-Master deserves his GWA title shot. Mm. So G-Master and I will have a unification match at the Clash of the Champions for the AWE American Continental Championship. And if... I Oh, no, no. When I walk out with the Global Wrestling Alliance champion today, instead of it being Kid in that match, it's going to be me. Oh, really? Kid's not going to make it to Clash of the Champions. That's well, the champion. we have some... De some uh, I de love him, but he's not going to make it. Well, we'll see about that. We have some definite... definite One time was a mistake. That won't be Actually, beat time. you twice. He beat you at Lawrence Mania, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two, once... To give me twice is a mistake. Three times, eh, eh. Huh. can't happen. There's your ego again, as always. I love it. But Donald Trump had an ego. Look what happened to him. Vince McMahon yeah, had an ego. Look what happened to him. Shawn Michaels had an ego. Look what happened to him. Hulk Hogan had an ego. Look what happened to him. Triple H had an ego. Look what happened to him. Not throwing it on the man. Rick Flair had an ego. Look what happened to him. My goodness, you have an ego and you cheat your way to keep your belt. So as you can see, great champions have. Eagles! Wait, wait, wait. Ah. Hulk Hogan and Ric Flair, they're wrestling, now they're wrestling in front of paying crowds of zero at the Impact Zone, the biggest shithole in Orlando, Florida. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. You shut the fuck up. Let's look at Triple H. He has an ego and no talent, so he had to marry the boss's daughter just to I marry that bitch too. And look at you. You have the ego, and you have to try to intimidate all these sycophants, these sheep, to get what you want. But you won't intimidate me. But look something, boo. Intimidation. If that's what works, it works. They have to have the mind over matter to not be intimidated. Kid did it last year. Really? And I was very proud of him. And you? Yeah, you did it before. But the point is, the difference between you, you just 
you have this record. Let's see how can I put it. Cheating. Like once you get the momentum, you can't keep it. No, I get the win. I'm, I've been the MSW World Heavyweight Champion for ten months now. Dang, you've been running. Pretty close to you've 11. been running out of the ring for ten months. That's nice. That's smart strategy. You call yourself the master <laughs> strategist, but I'm really the man with the strategy. Daddy's right I can fight a man straight on. Oh really? I can fight a man. I fought Derek Knight straight on. Speaking in the of Derek Knight, let's talk about a real man, the man who really did defeat you today. And should be the MSW champion. We'll, we'll, we'll talk to him in just a few minutes concerning that. Matter of fact, we'll talk to him right now. You don't get you you, you don't get the luxury of calling out the motion. Oh, picture. excuse me. So therefore, ladies and gentlemen, on my show, because he's gonna sit on my side, ladies and gentlemen, the motion picture, the AWE hardcore champion. No wait, AWE tradition champion. Okay, AWE tradition champion. That was nice that you actually acknowledged that. I'm always right. Shut up. You think Derek I'm Knight! Right. How you feeling, Knight? You shut your mouth right now. How'd you feel when I hit you with clinical depression? How'd you feel when I locked Wait, let's see what happened. Okay, you hit the clinical depression. How many times? Two, three times? What happened? I Just once. Out. You see all these idiots out there confusing DDT for a clinical depression. Well, but I kicked out, did I? I well, maybe if you can apply an uh, actual maneuver, right, we won't get confused. What? Well, and then I locked you in the STF. That always makes people tap out. But I grabbed the rope, didn't I? Strategy. He grabbed the rope. He's locked up with the law. I, I get won. to be the law today. I get so to be like a lawyer. Concerned, I had every right to hit you. You had every right to hit But you know what? You're going to get another opportunity belt. after. Cheap way to keep the belt. Because at the Clash of the Champions, we're going to have another unification match. Your AWE tradition title... I get my MSW World Heavyweight Championship. And when we were putting this show together, it was still a hardcore title. So this match is signed as a hardcore match. No disqualification, falls count anywhere. So guess what? I can legally hit you with the belt. And this time, you won't get a cheap DQ win. That's right, because I'm actually going to beat you this time. I'm actually going to get what is rightfully mine, the MSW. Heavyweight championship because really? I am tradition. I don't hit people with belts or cheat my way to win. I actually won two, three.